And we're back to learning GIMP and this time I'm going to show you how to create custom shapes. Just a simple example, but I haven't yet talked about it. At first we've got a white background and I click on this icon to create a new layer. Let me call it shape and I make it transparent. Just confirm it via OK and it's important that it's on top of the background. So if it's not, use this function down here. This layer is active and now I use the paths tool. You can also press B for that tool or you'll find it right here. It's comparable to a pen tool in for example Inkscape. You can left click to create straight lines or left click hold and drag to create curves. And you can reselect these nodes and adjust the angle with the handles right here. When you want to close the shape, you can hover over the first node right here and then just hold control. Your icon is going to change, left click and now it's a closed shape. Don't get worried if you select a different tool, the path is going to vanish, but it's still there. You'll just have to find right here the path menu and then we can see it. Now right click on it and go to path to selection. And now you can see that your path was still there and we've got it selected. Let me activate the move tool Then I go back to the layers menu. It's important that we are on our shape layer and now you can for example use the bucket fill tool right here. Let me switch it to black. And I left click on my selection and now we've got our custom shape filled with a color. I go to select none and it's the editable. So if I for example change the color, left click again with the bucket fill tool. Now it's red. I can move it around or scale it, transform it, whatever you want to do. So if you're totally new to GIMP, this is how you can create custom shapes and I hope this video was helpful. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.